call me Laika, and today, I will go over a bug that may affect your battery life if you are using Linux distribution with PyPy audio system, on a laptop or on another device with built-in camera. I will go over how to check if it affects you, and how to mitigate it until it gets fixed by upstream developers. If you don't know what PyPy is, or otherwise not sure whether you have it on your Linux installation, you can check that by running parctl info, command and checking server name line, or by searching for PyPy process in your system monitor. For reference, PipeWire is a software that manages access to media input and output, taking the role of audio server, screen recording permission manager, video input, and more. It's compatible with software that expects other audio servers, and is generally stable enough for many distributions to use it as default. And Wire Plumber is a default session manager for PipeWire, practically managing it as a background service. To check for this specific problem, you first need to ensure that none of your user applications are using camera explicitly. Then you can run a fuser command with a verbose flag and slash diff slash video null as input. And if it outputs something containing PyPy or Wire Plumber despite you explicitly not using camera at that moment, you might be having this bug. The other way of checking that you may use to be completely sure is installing PowTop Utility, running the sudo PowTop command, then navigating to device stats tab using tab key and using arrow keys to find your camera. If it's running at 100% despite not being in use, you have this bug. Your camera is constantly powered which may result in noticeable battery drain. Now, if you know are affected, you can temporarily mitigate the issue by adding a specific config file in Wire Plumber config folder. You can copy file path and text from my blog or from the description. After that, you should restart Wire Plumber service either by running command like system to restart double dash user Wire Plumber or by rebooting. This will stop pipe wire from monitoring camera usage, which will have a side effect of breaking camera and use indicators in KDE or GNOME environments. But you should notice that previously shown evidence of camera being constantly powered is no longer present. Mitigating this issue may noticeably improve your battery life, though it depends on hardware for how noticeable it will actually be. If this video was hard to follow, you can ask for clarifications in the comments, same for any factual mistakes I could have made. Also, as developers are already working on a fix, I will update the video description and pin comment with a version this fix will land in. But for now take care. I hope to see you later.